Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, back to Scrap Mechanic, and today we're back over engineering some weapons, and this weapon is going to be just spud guns that shoot the bots, you know, nothing out of the ordinary, except the spud guns are going to be lining a tunnel that I'm going to lead the bots through, and we're going to see how many bots can make it through a tunnel that is constantly shooting at them. Now, tunnels are fun. They're fun to drive through. They're fun to walk through, but uh, they're even more fun when they're filled with sensor triggered spud guns that shoot potatoes in your face as you walk through it. Maybe fun isn't the right word. Well, it depends on if you're the person wa walking through it or if you're the person watching others walk through it. It's all relative. It's going to be fun for someone here. Hopefully, mostly for you guys, the viewers. So my plan with this is I'm not going to have the tunnel be made of spud guns. I'm just going to have it have a handful of spud guns here and there. And then we're going to spawn various swarms of bots and we're going to find the limits of the tunnel. In other words, how much can it handle before a bot actually manages to make it through the tunnel? So I think that's going to be kind of fun. And we're even going to see if this guy is going to be able to do it. All right, I want to build this thing out of glass so we can see we can see through the tunnel from the outside. But uh, oh, yeah, that works. OK, I was hoping that armored glass wasn't going to be susceptible to spud guns because the tunnel might shoot itself otherwise. So there are a lot of ways I can envision that'll make this extremely deadly, but I'm not going to make this overkill. So I don't know if you guys saw my one shot farm bot killer weapon video where I built the thing that kind of wraps around the farm bot and uh, shoots it with 60 or so spuds. But I'm going to take a similar approach to that where I build one section at a time and then weld them on top of each other. So I'm going to start with one arch first. No spuds yet. I can add the spud guns onto it later, but I think this is going to be the simplest way to do it. Okay, and just like this, I believe we have a completed archway. Look at that. That doesn't look half bad. This will be a good segment to copy and paste. All right, so now we need to make this thing actually trigger when some bots walk through it. But we're going to have one sensor on either side, so that way it shouldn't matter what side you're walking in the tunnel from. The spud gun should get triggered at the right time from either direction, and a logic gate's going to help us with that as well. We hook the spud gun into the logic gate. We hook both sensors in and set that to an OR gate. Now, no matter which uh, sensor triggers first, it should, yeah, each sensor, there we go. Each sensor should trigger the spud gun. All right, we're doing good so far. And it doesn't shoot the other side. All right, now we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. All right, I think I got them all hooked up. Let's see if they all actually detect me. Okay, okay, no. Oh wait, you know what? You know what would probably help? If they weren't set to one range. How about that? All right, now let's see if they all detect me. Oh, they actually do. I wasn't sure if the angles were actually going to be all centered. Oh boy, this is actually more deadly than I intended it to be already. I didn't realize how many spuds were gonna simultaneously be hitting these things. So this is gonna annihilate any single bot other than the uh, farm bot that comes through this thing. All right, but this is gonna be fun. Oh, this is gonna be real fun. Look at that. All right, how long do you think we can make this tunnel before it lags out? <laughs> so when I spawn the segments in, this is what they do. This is this is uh, not making it very intuitive as far as welding goes, but it, it should be fine. I think I just gotta weld that part. To th oh, that doesn't make things easy, does it? I weld that part. To that part? I think that makes sense. Does this make sense? Let's spawn it in. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, why is it already laggy? Hold on. Hold on. Do I gotta weld? Oh. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, this is this makes things difficult. I can't reach the top of this on the uh on the lift. Gotta bring the trusty toilet out. There we go. There we go. Okay, uh is this is this gonna lag? Uh-oh. 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 Why is it so laggy already? Okay, it lag hold on, let me get rid of these ones. These ones are kind of like probably interfering too. Please give me some frames back after these. 
Okay, okay, this is good. This is good. I got some frames back. All right, this isn't lagging anymore. It was those other ones. Those other ones were lagging it, not the actual tunnel itself. Okay, there we go. There we go. The fact that I have to wield all these individual sections is actually kind of funny. All right, how's this doing? How are we doing now? Still 60 frames. All right. Oh. 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 What? What does that mean? Is it because of the toilet? Is it the toilet? Why is it doing that? It's like a fish. It's like a fish out of water. Is something wrong with the controllers? Why is it doing this? Okay, hold on. All right, put it on the lift. Everything should be facing in this direction. It should all come to this direction. All the spud guns are on the outside of the tunnel. What did I do? What did I do? Okay, you know what I think? You know what? You, uh, I don't know. I, I'm a little bit confused as to why that would happen. They should all be working together to have the same angles. All right, let's save this and let's just double this. All right, it's gonna be really hard to grab this with it freaking out like this. Come on, please, just, I just need to weld this section right here. Can you stop? Can you stop for one second? There we go, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay, okay, all right. Now we just gotta weld all these individual parts back. Does it work? Oh, no. Oh, no. Don't worry, I got an idea. I got an idea. I got an idea. Okay, what's my idea? I'm gonna start over. I'm so I have to start over. All right, I gotta start back from square one here because I just, I did this wrong. This is very, very confusing. What's confusing about it is the way it spawns in is very different than how it looks on the lift. So it's kind of confusing to get an idea of which side belongs to which side. But I think that side belongs to that side. All right, I'm just gonna pay really close attention. See, that folds fine, no issues. It's gonna pay really close attention to which side is which. All right, does it still work? <gasps> Why? Why doesn't it still work? I know, oh, no, it's coming after me. <laughs> You're like Indiana Jones with the rock, or uh, rock tumbling after him. Okay, I don't know why it does this. All right, one more weld. Just one more weld. If you just stay still, if you just stay still. Did I get it? Did I get it? I got it. All right, let's see what happens. Oh, it's laggy. Oh, it's laggy, but it's curved. It is laggy, but it is angled. It's like a right angle now. It's not how I built this. All right, let's weld it to the ground and hope that welding it solves all of my problems. Okay, come on down. I got more problems. This is not a tunnel. This is not the tunnel I was looking for. All right, so what I'm trying now is I deleted uh, a layer of blocks in between each folding segment because I think the folding segments, the corners were rubbing into each other, which was causing the glitchiness, maybe. And I'm just trying to eliminate that by putting pipe pieces here that have less friction with the surrounding thing. All right, so now here's two sections on each other. Let's see if this feels any better. So far, so good. Okay, here we go. If this works, if this doesn't glitch out, then it is better. It is a better improvement on the previous version. Okay, please don't glitch out when I take you off the lift. I think that was it. I think it was the corners. It was just the corners uh, going into each other. Do you think I can double this once more? Please let this work. Look how good this tunnel's gonna be. It's gonna be a long tunnel. All right, moment of truth. Will it freak out? Will it lag? Or will it just be a longer tunnel? <gasps> what? Okay, this is, this is good. This is, this is good. This is, no, 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 don't do that. Don't do that, none of this. No, I think it's good. I think this is it. I'm gonna save this right now, spud. Tunnel. All right, now all I gotta do is weld this to the ground. Ready? Please work. Is it, is it working? I mean, the ground isn't the most even. Why is it higher over here? I think it's because it's actually contacting the ground over there. We need flatter ground. All right, you know what? I'm gonna have to build a walkway for this, I think. Oh no.
Why is this be? This is like the suspended mountain bridges. <laughs> it just doesn't want to cooperate. Ah! I almost fixed it. Don't worry, I almost fixed it. See, look, look, it's fine. It's a perfectly working, perfectly healthy spud tunnel now. Wait, what? Oh no, did I really forget? Did I forget to put these ones on max? All right, I think we got it. I think we actually got it now. This thing's working right now. It is fine right now. Let's start some actual tests. We're gonna start with a greenie. And see, it's gonna be really simple. He's on that side, I'm on this side. His goal is to get to me. <laughs> it's, just, it's just instant annihilation. All right, let's start with a single Haybot then. He's on that side, I'm on this side. You just gotta get to me. <laughs> so good. It, oh no, oh no. Oh, no. It's so good. It's so good. Okay, let's try a whole line of greenies. A whole bunch of them. All right, ready? Aggro all. Here they come. Oh, it's laggy. How far are they gonna make it? <laughs> it's actually really, really good. Other than the lag, this is a laggy piece of equipment here. This is a really, really good weapon. All right, let's try a whole bunch of Haybots. I feel like the Haybots have a better chance because they're faster moving. I didn't even think, is a farm bot gonna fit in this tunnel? A farm bot might not fit in here. That's gonna be really bad. All right, here we go. Oh, they're just going right after me. Here they come. I feel like they don't even stand a chance. Come at me, bros. Oh. Aggro all. Not all of them were actually coming after me. All right, here's the next wave. They're so dead. They're just, it, oh, this one guy actually kind of decided to go around. Hey, you want to follow me in? You want to come in from this side? You want to come on in? <laughs> all right, let's do a variety, a bunch of greenies and a bunch of haybots. All right, I'm thinking this is definitely gonna lag out my game for a little bit until enough of them get destroyed, but it's worth it. All right, here we go, aggro all. Oh yeah, it's definitely a little bit laggy. You think anyone's gonna make it to me? This is a wall of bots going through a tunnel of spud guns. Oh, they're, oh no, that's not how this is designed to work. <laughs> okay, that doesn't count, they went around. That doesn't count if they go around. Ah! They're actually making it through the tunnel. No, they didn't. I don't think anyone actually got through the tunnel itself. And hey, 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 I said no aggro creations. I definitely said no aggro creations. It's on now. Turn it back off, please. Ah, all right, I gotta lead them back through the tunnel. Stop attacking my tunnel. All right, follow me, follow me through the tunnel. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, we still got a couple of stragglers. Come after me. Come on after me. All right, and they're all gone. Okay, that was a little bit more chaotic than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> all right, let's try a farm bot. I'm really worried he's not gonna fit through the tunnel, but we gotta try it. Please come through the tunnel. Come on, you can make it. You just, you're on the side right now. Oh, here he, he made it through. It's not good enough. It's not good enough. It's not good enough. Come on through again. Come on through again. I don't think he, I don't think he can make it through a second time. Come on. Get over here. All right, here he comes. I think this is gonna do it. I think this is gonna kill him once he gets in. If he gets in. Are you gonna get in? Oh, here he comes. Oh, that's it. That was it. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, that's painful. Oh. 
Okay, they, they've, they're, they're kind of a, whoa, <laughs> they're kind of an even match. The farm bot and the tunnel, they definitely kind of destroyed each other. Oh my good, it's just going everywhere. All right, you know what? We have to clear creations. Please come straight, please go straight. Yes. Oh, it's not enough, but how much? All right, can he, will he come right back through? Oh my goodness, do you see that? It's literally one segment too small to uh, take out the farm bot with one pass through. Oh wow, it survived. It actually didn't damage it. If there was one more row of spuds, then he would be dead. Which kinda, kinda makes me want to, uh... I'm gonna spawn in one more section here. All right, here we go. Yes! It is the Tunnel of Doom. Oh, it worked. Two times in a row. Don't do that. No, 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 don't do that. Don't do, no, I'm right here, I'm right here. Don't, I'm right here. What are you doing? You can see me. Yes. Oh, okay. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. It's gonna work. Oh, it is just in time. And it's perfect because he tumbles out and explodes, which means he's not gonna actually explode the tunnel. This is like the perfect weapon right here. I would not recommend doing this in an actual survival world because the amount of resources and lag this would cause just for something as novel as this. It's amazing. It's amazing that he just always collapses right at the end. It's so consistent. Out of all the inconsistencies that we've just witnessed, the fact that it's one job is actually consistent is amazing. I just wish it would actually settle on the ground on this side. All right, you know, what? I'm gonna try, uh, I'm gonna regret this, but I'm taking, all right, I know I'm gonna regret this for this last bit here, but I'm gonna take it off of its weld point so it's just resting on the ground. Oh no, oh no, there it goes. I knew I was gonna regret this. I knew I was gonna regret this. There it goes. Please don't mess up. When I shoot a spud through it, it triggers the sensors. It's kind of funny. No, 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 no. Why are you doing this? Why are you? Okay, fine, 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 fine. Come after me. No, 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 no. This way, 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 this way. Ah! That's actually more epic if he's following you through the tunnel. Okay, and it's good. All right, all right, last time. Last time with him following me. Ah, here he comes. <laughs> Wait, what? What are you? No, 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 no aggro creation. No, I said no. I said no aggro creation. Hey, no, 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 don't do that. Oh, okay, he's dead. Okay, he's just gonna blow it up again. What? Did he not actually... Oh, he did a little bit of damage to the pipe pieces. That's pretty much it. All right, well, this was actually another overwhelming success when it comes to these uh, over-engineered and impractical weapons. This was not nearly as laggy as I was expecting it to be, especially with a tunnel of this length, and the fact that it was just enough to take out a boss just as he got to the end was just the icing on top. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know if you have any other ideas of stuff you'd like to see me create in Scrap Mechanic or other games too. If you enjoyed this, you'll probably enjoy some other stuff on the channel, so go ahead and check out this on the end screen right here. If you want to support the channel, check out the merch store. Hope this video has earned your subscription. Anyway, this has been Scrapman, and I'll see you next time. Bye.